Hey guys, look what I got in the mail today. My 2018 Grizzly Tool Catalog. I always look forward to getting these because I like looking through them. Probably like most of you, see what's available. And I tell you, every year it seems like they just keep raising the prices. I remember when I first started looking at the G0602 the 10 by 22 bench lathe I think with shipping it was just over a thousand dollars it was ninety nine dollars shipping and nine hundred and something dollars nine seventy five maybe now we're all the way up to fourteen hundred and fifty and they, it looks like they've even increased the shipping and we're four hundred and fifty four hundred seventy five dollars more than what it was just three or four years ago and uh, I mean the variable speed version is nineteen hundred and seventy five to me that's just discouraging really discouraging one thing the 12 by 24 is over three grand now and it used to be around 2400 The 4003 is 3195 Still a good deal compared to the 12 by 24 You're only talking about $100 for another 12 inches. But a lot of people don't really need the length for CNC work. So really, to me, it doesn't really matter that much. If we take a look at the milling machines, 1375 for the 704. If I'm not mistaken, that price hasn't really changed that much. Um, probably because it's a real popular mill, but I remember it just a few years ago being around $1,000 as well. But I don't think it's changed that much from last year, but I may be wrong. For those of you who maybe purchased one recently, uh, over the last six months, maybe you have a better under idea. I'll have to look in last year's catalog and see. The Precision Matthew 727 equivalent, the G0795, is... I think it's around about the same price as well but probably because they're in competition with Precision Matthews on that anyways a little disheartening that you know as popular as some of these machines are they just keep raising the price and uh, I know they're selling them so I don't understand why they have to can't give you a, a a deal on some of the popular ones but then again maybe they are like I said maybe the price of the 704 uh, looks to be about the same so maybe they are at any rate I checked online and these prices seem to coincide with what's online so happy new year here we are in 2016 and the Here's the 4002 and 4003, 2850. Good deal for that lathe. Here's our 704, 1225. And this is up from the prior year, I believe. $99 shipping. Well, here's the 795. At sixteen twenty-five, so it's only went up about a hundred dollars in the last three years. So that's a good deal. Let's look at two thousand seventeen. Thirteen twenty-five, 
The price of shipping went up a few dollars, about ten dollars. For the variable speed version, seventeen ninety five. Twenty seven ninety five for the twelve twenty four. And twenty nine twenty five for the four thousand three. And let's look at the popular 704, 1250. As you can see, it didn't go up in price that much. Sixteen seventy five for the seven nine five. That's it for this video guys, just a quick video, um, trying to get organized and get back out into the shop and get things going, uh, working on the wiring for the uh, servo up upgrade, so hopefully that will be coming up soon. I've got a trip planned next weekend and then I'm going to be going out of town for a couple of weeks, so the video is going to be posting pretty slow for the next month or so, so hang in there. But we'll get back on it once I get back up to full speed. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe. If you're interested in any of the plans for the G0602, you can stop by the website and pick the conversion plans up. It's still a pretty good deal, even at $1450, but and another $500 for <clears throat> a VFD version. However, you could pick up a DMM servo cheaper than the $500 and have a servo motor for your spindle and then end up with rigid tapping. Well, that wraps up this video. If you're interested in any of my CNC conversion plans for the G0602 or the Precision Matthews, you can stop by and visit the website. Happy New Year's, guys. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe, and most importantly, be safe.